Hi there, students. Ethos. Okay, the ethos of somebody, the ethos of a group. This talks about the fundamental values, the character, the spirit or the attitude. So, for example, in teaching English, my ethos is the most important thing is communication. Speaking and understanding and being able to communicate well to native speakers. My ethos is that grammar is less important because normally grammar is too complicated to think about while you are speaking. You just need to know what, is, what sounds correct. You can study the grammar afterwards, but my ethos places the emphasis on uh, communication. Okay, so this is the idea of this word ethos. The mentality, the mindset, if you like. The underlying uh, feeling. So, for example, what is the ethos of the people in the UK? Well, I guess it's playing fair, um, giving opportunities to people. If you work hard, you will do well. Yeah, so rewarding people or getting just rewards for uh, working hard. This is the ethos. I don't know if it's true, but... Let's see, th this word comes from Greek, from ethos, meaning the character of something. This word is clearly related to ethics, ethical, um, things like that. Um, so, I'm not very happy with the ethos of our modern society, which seems to be, we must make money at all costs, and I'm all right, Jack. This phrase, I'm all right, Jack, I'm in a good situation, so I have no reason to take care of anyone else. Okay, so the ethos, it's the underlying spirit, the way that you do something, the basic values and principles that you think are the important part of something, are the important way of doing it. So, what's your ethos to learning English? You want to know every single detail, or are you just happy to bumble along? Okay, so ethos, the ethos of somebody. So what about formality? I think this word ethos is probably slightly formal. I'm not sure I would use it in an informal conversation in the pub. I think I'd probably use a word like spirit or something like that. I think ethos I would keep to something semi-formal or very formal. Yeah? So, the spirit of the age. Yeah? The ethos. The, maybe the zeitgeist. But zeitgeist, yeah. Zeitgeist and ethos are certainly well linked. I think the zeitgeist is the ethos of a particular era. Yeah, um, Maybe we have the ethos that science is the cure for everything and science will resolve our problems with global war warming. And I think we need to change our ethos and say, I need to do something personally about it. Okay, so ethos. If you enjoyed the video, give it a rating, subscribe to my channel, and I'll see you soon. Bye for now. Ethos.